A'udhu Billahi Minash Shaitanir Rajeem, Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. My name is Salim Khalid. I'm sitting here with Brother Jamil Sayyid, Alhamdulillah. We've uh, had a wonderful conversation as he prepares to embark upon the Mu'adhan project, Alhamdulillah. And uh, what I'd like to share with the, uh, the listening audience and what I'd like to suggest first and foremost is that those of you who are touched with the knowledge of this effort, that you begin with dua to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and ask Allah to bless this effort and make this effort, make the, the distance that needs to be traveled to be easily traveled and that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would help Jamil and help the individual that is accompanying him, inshallah ta'ala, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala would give them the best of intentions and make their travel and their effort a effort of ease, inshallah ta'ala. And um, I, I think that people need to understand and appreciate that this is something that is wonderful for all of us, not just for Jamil and the brother that's traveling with him, but all of our community here in North America, that very simply at this time, in this day, in this age, given all of the things that are going on, what better that people's attention be drawn to, come to prayer, come to success, that the uh, call to prayer, alhamdulillah, begins literally the process of reawakening the Muslim mind and heart and refocusing their attention upon their provider, Allah Azza wa Jal, and the reason for our existence. And that in addition to traveling to all of the 50 states and uh, being able to make the call uh, to prayer in all of those states, that Jamil will also get an opportunity to deliver a short talk, a qatar, that will again help people to refocus uh, and pay attention to the final words of our beloved Prophet Muhammad, may the peace and blessings of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala be upon him. Uh, where he clarified again literally our reason for existence. And if nothing more than these two things, the adhan, the call to prayer, the call to access, and a reminder of this final khutbah uh, is given to the people that this will be a light, alhamdulillah, that will illuminate through these 50 states, inshallah ta'ala, through this effort. That uh, again, in today's time, uh, with all of the things going on around us, the best that we can do and what we have to offer is this light of this world. And again, we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to bless this effort to guide these young brothers as they move forth throughout North America and to return them safely to us. We'll ask the brothers and sisters in the various communities that they're traveling to, to welcome them, welcome them with open arms and to share with them another aspect of this effort is that each state will be given the opportunity where they stop to share with the people on the viewing end of this effort and this product what they are doing in their particular locale. And again, this is tremendously important that people understand that Muslim people are part and parcel of North America now. That we are here, that we're rooted in this, that we have a stake in this, that we're delivering and we have been delivering service not only to our community, but to the society at large. So in closing, uh, we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to guide Jamil and the brother that will accompany him to uh, speed forward their movement uh, through the 50 states, uh, which in and of itself is a massive effort, and to keep clear for them their focus, uh, to, uh, to, to make clear to them and keep clear to them their intention, their reason for doing this, and to bring them safely home to us. Amen. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi. We're very